great thing that you made your decision to come to Los Angeles. Did you ever think about being a Laker before? Uh, when I was growing up, of course. I mean, I always thought about being on the receiving end of a Magic Johnson pass or kicking it out to uh, Michael Cooper, Byron Scott. And I'm just glad that I had the opportunity to, to become a free agent. And I think, you know, moving to Los Angeles was the best thing for me to do. I think it's a new start for me. Why did you choose this one? I, I don't think you do things just for I don't think you have to do things for money anymore. Correct. I mean, at first it was, we had, you know, told people, look, we want to stay in Orlando. We want to, you know, try to, you know, work things out, whatever, whatever. And then, you know, they came with their deal. And then Jerry West came with a deal and, and you know, I mean, I just took the best deal. And I realized that there's a lot of tradition on this team and there's a lot of tradition in the organization. So I decided to start all over and I think that this is a new start for me. I think it's a new start for you and an opportunity to travel the road to a championship ring. That's right. Don't you? That's what it's all about. Well, now you're a Laker. You've got all new teammates. Has the adjustment so far been difficult? Not at all. I mean, I think, you know, once I learn the system and learn the plays, you know, we're going to be hard to beat. And I think if we just go out there, play our roles, play together, and stay on the same page, we should be fine. When you joined the team, Shaq, I worried about the chemistry. And that worry has passed. Man, your chemistry couldn't be greater. Uh, I also wondered who would be the leader. Will it be you? Will it be Van Exel? You and Van Exel are pretty close. Van Exel is, is the point guard. Of course, he's going to be the leader. Yeah. And I'm, I'm not that much of a vocal leader. I mean, I don't like to embarrass guys out there on the court when they make a mistake. So I try to lead by example, just by playing, diving on the floor, working hard. I think if we all just you know, stick together through thick and thin, then we should be fine. Up front now, you guys got a pretty good starting line with Eldon, yourself, and uh, the Sabalos. We have a very unselfish starting lineup. And on any given night, any one of us players could take over. Nick could dominate his spot. Eddie is, you know, can dominate his spot. We all know, you know, Cedric is a great slasher. You know, not all teams in the West have a great power forward, so there's going to be a lot of mismatches with, you know, Eldon Campbell. And I'm just going to go out there and do my thing. So hopefully if we, you know, put all those pieces together, we can be hard to beat.